Hey y'all, what's up? It's your girl Millie. If you're new, what's good, what's happening? Or if you're not, welcome back. Um, sorry I've been MIA. I've been dealing with a lot of personal things. I don't know if y'all can really hear me due to the... I'm behind a car wash, so it just sounds like a bunch of vacuum and stuff, but... I'm at Wendy's. I got a strawberry lemonade because you can't go wrong with strawberry lemonade from Wendy's. But y'all. What the fuck? How has life been going? Life has been okay. Well, it's been great. I'm still blessed as always. I should tell her no onions. The way she put this motherfucker on now. Huh? But y'all, yeah, life has been life and life is whooping my ass. Um, right now I probably I'm a so my seat adjustment adjustment. I don't know if y'all can tell, but like I'm short as fuck, so. It's, the power of it is not working. Um, I can't move back and forth. I mean, so now I have to use a pillow and I have back problems from my past um, car accident. It's really annoying, but it's not to the point like it's gonna piss me off. Like I can still reach the pillow with the pillow. I said, I'm gonna stack my money for a couple of weeks and then I'm gonna take my car. Cause I have all these chips coming up and I'm just tired of all this. I had a four for four. I should have did a bacon cheeseburger. But I got five snickers in this burger and strawberry lemonade. Me and my boyfriend was supposed to go to seafood, but they called him back into work, so he's off tomorrow. So we're just gonna go do this tomorrow. But yeah, I'm not really mad about my car. I told myself this year, 2024, I'm not getting mad at stuff that I can no longer control. Shit happens. After this, after I'm done eating, I'm gonna drive to my mom's house to go drop off her Christmas present. But, 
A Valentine's Day sale coming up by Embrace Our Beauty Studio. If y'all don't know what that is up your new here, that is my hair collection. I sell hair. I said this year, we're all about making money and happiness. Simple. I already have a bunch of ideas on a bunch of new video ideas on um, what I want to do next. So I'm really excited about that. Why the fuck he got to come park right next to me? I hate when people park right next to me. That just pisses my soul off because this is an empty ass parking lot. So why the fuck you have to come park right next to me? Mmm. They not just be so good. Nuggets, 10 out of 10. Normally I get it like a 10 piece nugget, but I kind of wanted a burger. I really wanted Wingstop, but I didn't feel like driving them, so. never go wrong with Wendy's Nuggets because I'm not really a big fan of McDonald's Nuggets. I don't I don't really fuck with it unless I'm like I'm high then I eat it but when I'm sober oh no mm I really just been working Monday to Friday. But I was off for Christmas and I was off for New Year's, so I had a three day weekend back to back. But for New Year's, I was supposed to go back to work that Tuesday, but I ended up going back on Wednesday. I don't know what it is, but ever since I came back from Austin in December, I haven't been feeling it. Like, I just feel like I've wasted so many years on my talent. If y'all don't know, I used to do hair, but I had stopped. That's another story time. I do a story time on that later, but. I stopped you know just for personal reasons um and I've been applying for new nine to five jobs Monday through Friday weekends off and holidays off since August resume is good than a bitch I promise y'all I might post it <laughs> but nobody has getting back has been getting back to me and I just feel like maybe God trying to tell me hey like you need to get the fuck up and you need to start me doing hair you wasting talent so i'm gonna listen i'm gonna for sure listen my stomach is still growling like i'm feeding you right now but yeah y'all nothing exciting has been happening i'm actually getting ready for my photo shoot um and my flyers like i'm really excited so and I started back taking clients. So, yeah, I'm really excited about this year. Like, this year's already starting good. Like, I already started making money, like, without my 9 to 5, you know? I started back going to school January 16th after MLK Day. Four classes. I believe two is online anytime. One is um, online on a schedule. And then one one is um, in person. I don't know if it's on Saturdays because I'm off on Saturdays. And I just probably did an 8 a.m. to probably 9.30. I'm not sure. I'll have to look back at my schedule. But 
um, financial aid and everything has already been done. So I'm really excited to start being going back to school in person. I haven't been in somebody's schoolhouse since this whole. I haven't been in somebody's schoolhouse since 2020. It's 2024. But yeah. I'm really excited. I already did my vision board. I'm going to show y'all that later. But I did a pink themed vision board. Pink everything. Like all my goals and stuff. I'm not going to really talk about it because I don't want to get into detail because I feel like that's bad luck. But yeah. This year is really all about being happy, making more money, having multiple streams of income. What else? What else? And pursuing my dreams because I always say when I die or like when I, when I'm whenever I'm on my deathbed, I don't never want to be like, oh, I wish like I could have did this. I don't never want to be like that. Like I just feel like we're all here for a purpose you know we need to serve our purpose if god don't want me to work nine to five then he don't want me to work nine to five shit i'm gonna use my motherfucking talent also i did say that i was gonna stop drinking and smoking and cussing but i'm doing good with the drinking and smoking part so far it's just the cussing Stop at McDonald's have the best fries, hands down. Don't argue with me, argue with your mama. Mm. I'm gonna mix that up some more. I haven't eaten nothing since yesterday at 12 30 lunch it's been a whole 24 hours but yeah I'm so so excited For the photo shoot. I've been working nonstop to get everything together. I'm a perfectionist, like it has to be done right. So I'm not gonna lie to you. I graduate and I graduate next year. I believe so. Is it the next year or year after next? 2026. Because right now I'm just doing my prereqs. I didn't even get to the radiology part.
And sometimes I feel like, oh. But back to all this, sometimes I feel like social media makes people believe that it's not okay to not know what you want to do in your 20s. It's perfectly okay. I didn't know what I wanted to do until maybe I was 20. I'm 20, 20. Oh, shit. I'm 22. I'm 22 now and I finally realized I, I mean but I knew that I always wanted to be in the hair care in the medical field but I knew for sure that I didn't want to be a nurse like I know that was like off the list I knew that I'm gonna be BRN I want to be able to go in whenever I feel like it and not really have to stress about nothing because my goal was to always do it here on the side. I just want to be set. That's it. Come with a plan. something in my eye. Mm. I don't know when I'm going to take my car to the shop. Giving all my problems to God. Y'all, when I was little, I never used to eat the corn side. I used to take both ends off and then eat it. I think I stopped doing that two years ago. I don't know, but. next to me um. alright y'all I'm gonna go see my mama so I will talk to y'all later this is too fucking sweet bro <laughs> Is this something here? Look. Let me stop playing. But alright. Bye, y'all.